This is a demonstration of how a screen reader is used to navigate a learning management system. We are going to be using the canvas.net learning management system for this demonstration and JAWS as the screen reading program. We will be using arrow keys, tabs, and other navigation keyboard commands to navigate this page and learn where links are located or how many links are located on this page. Seems like modules might be a good place to start our navigation. So it looks like there is a heading called Start Here. Start here, list of 12 item, link canvas, user, or wiki page, link welcome, survey, quiz, zero PTS, link general, course content, questions, discussion topic, link course overview, course overview. Maybe I need to see what the course overview is, and I press enter when I hear it. Enter, course overview, visited link, course overview, colon, accessibility, colon, designing and teaching courses for all learners, course overview. Accessibility Poland designing and teaching courses for all learners. Frame 1. Accessibility MOOC dash YouTube. Updated. Page has one frame, six regions, two headings, and 26 links. List of three items visited link CN 1883. Visited link pages course overview list and breadcrumbs navigation region at 2016 Q1 context navigation region list of four items visited link home. Link home. So this gives me the course overview, but I don't know, so I'm going to use the N key. Heading level one course overview. Engaging in this course will help you understand civil rights issues surrounding accessibility and empower you to design. So there are keyboard navigation buttons, um, handlers, for when on the internet that allows a user to jump to different sections of the screen. If I press the B button to see if there is any link. Previous button, previous colon, general course content, questions. So previous is general course content questions. Next button, next colon, preparing for the course. So I, there is a next button, so preparing for the course. So to activate the next button, I'm going to press enter. Enter, next button, visited. Next colon, preparing for the course. Just to make sure that this page also has the buttons, so I know whether I can go back or forward, I am going to press the B button again. Previous button, next button. So it, they do have the previous and next button, which lets me know that I am able to navigate back and forth between the pages um, um, and able to visit something that I may want to at a later date. If I don't want to go next and I want to go back and read my course overview again, I would be able to do that easily enough. So consistency in design and knowing that things are in place allows for easy navigation of uh, LMS systems and it allows the user to have that familiarity that they s need um, in order to get things done in time or at least keep up with the content.